Hey, what's going on, beautiful people? It's Dante, and welcome to Until Dawn. I have never seen a trailer or anything from this game. I just heard it's a horror game. And a few of you already know that horror games and I, we are really, really not good friends. I haven't even pressed on New Story yet, and I'm already really, really scared. We are just not so good friends, but we are going to pull through. Let's just do this. Oh great, we're already doomed. Oh, if we have to choose our actions, oh my god, I'm really not good in that. Already fucked. I really love snow down. Oh, M Michael Myers in the building. on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, and Just because he's class prez doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, um, I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever. You Everybody say, fighting out. Everybody fighting now over one dude? Really? <laughs> Look at that. Did you see that mask? They're not gonna be mean to her though. It's Hannah. Hey Hannah. Oh oh, it's gonna go down. <laughs> what was that Riddick? Hey, did you see that? Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Josh. Oh, it's up to me! Oh, I'm walk oh! Oh my, look at, oh my, oh my, look at that ass, let's go a bit in the light. Oh yeah! She <laughs> oh, okay, I could walk with her around for days. Can we do anything? No, I guess, okay, this is then only the tutorial intro kind of thing, I guess, so, oh, we can, I lied. Hannah, you look so damn hot in that shirt, but I bet you're even hotter out of it. Oh my god, that was a, such a cheesy... Jesus Christ, that's such a cheesy line. Come to the guest room at 2 a.m., Mike. Oh my god. What so, did our naive sister get herself into now? Ugh. So technically, time. Mike is hitting on Hannah. Can we push him down? Can we push him off the chair? <gasps> no, we can't. All right. I'm a bit scared. I'm scared that something, a jump scare is already now going to happen. Oh, ah, so, okay, so things that we can investigate, they will blink up. Let's go. Is this a door, though? I, I don't want to go through a door. No! Oh, thank God. Let's investigate everything. <laughs> That's one ugly plant. <laughs> could, have, could have used some water, in my, in my opinion. I Oh, maybe we, maybe we have to look out of the... Oh, my God, let's go to the main door. All right, all right. 
Okay, so he's passed out too. Jeremiah Crag since 1794. Okay. Can I look underneath it too or something? No. And what was now the whole point? Jeez, Josh. Oh. Once again, brother, you've outdone us oh. all. To find out why he's drunk. I got your note. Glad you can make it. Oh, the note was not from Mike. Now I got it. It's the prank. Oh my god, I hate bullies. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Oh, uh, I can't. I hope he dies first. I really hope he dies first. Oh my god. She's taking her shirt off. What? Oh my god. Matt. Oh my god. What are you doing here? And that dude holding oh, the camera? Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, it's all good. It's just a stupid prank. Uh. Jerks. You know that? For real, tell him. Hannah. That was just Hannah or not? To choose? What do I have to choose? What do I have to choose? Wake Josh, find others. Uh Got I didn't oh, oh, I already chose? Someone outside. Shit. I'm now I'm gonna die. Oh no. <laughs> Where's my sister going? It's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We were just messing around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! Hannah! So, should we go after her? No, let's no, split up. You're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Let's split up like in every bad horror oh, movie. Shit. Press the correct actions. Oh! Okay. Holy shit. Oh no, fast, safe, uh, 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 safe. Yeah. I don't want to break a leg or some shit. Because then we're really fucked. I'm gonna get killed first. And oh my god, she's gonna get killed first. I lied. Uh, follow noise. Follow footprints. Uh-oh. No, be nice. Oh, God. Jesus. Fuck. Shit. Damn it, Hannah. Where are you? Use the what? Oh, 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 oh. oh. Ah. Status up. Hannah. Oh, oh, we have to move again. Okay, you can direct the light. Ah, got it. All right, I didn't know. Sorry. Okay, we have one way to go. Hannah. Hannah, where is you? I hope she has a shirt on though. Oh my god, if she doesn't have a shirt on, her nipples are freezing the fuck off, like for real. Oh my god. Hannah! Oh. Good reindeer. Oh, oh hell, uh, L1. Alright, let's walk faster. Can we sprint? No. Why am I holding it always to the left? Hello? Can we Hello? hold it in front of me, please? <laughs> okay, we don't want to hold the light in front of me. Oh, what's this? What is that? Oh shit, a death totem. Totem pro prophecies, black death, the possible death of the person who finds it. Oh great. Tribes believe that butterflies, I shouldn't have picked it up then. Each totem piece, blah blah, foretells future event, how you play will determine whether or not these prophecies come true. As you unlock totems, the event of the past will become clear. Okay. Okay, so it's me falling down. Found on the... M okay, I fall down and break my back. Okay, let's not do that. Let's not fall down and let's not break our back. Totem of death. We're fucked. Hannah! Maybe she... Huh? 
Oh. Oh, did you guys see that on the left side on the top? There was a lighting. <gasps> there was Hello. light. I don't have foot. Oh, yes, I do. I do have footprints. Okay. Oh! What the fuck? What the hell was that? A dragon. <gasps> Dragons confirmed. That was a dragon. Oh, who's that? Who's that? Hannah. Let's go back, Hannah. At least she has a shirt on. Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. Oh no, 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 no. Let let run! Hannah, is that Run! Yeah! Double time, bitches! Double time! Hannah! Oh my god. Oh, That was a crap mobile anyway. <laughs> oh, this is where I'm gonna break my back! No! No, 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 no! Shit. This is where I break my back! No. Don't hold on to her! No. Let go! No. Okay, we have to make the right decision here. Oh, shit. That ass though. Drop Hannah, let go. Drop Hannah, let go, let go. Uh, drop Hannah. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. No! No, I made the wrong decision. Fuck. Shit, now we're both dead. Oh my god. Oh my god. Already, already done fucked up. <laughs> Oh my god, that was an asshole choice though too. But either way, if I would have dropped her, I would have fallen. Begin, there I let are go. a few things I need to make sure you understand. Oh my god. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom. This revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. Oh, from now on. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. This is not creepy at all. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying. But I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? Yeah, what else am I going to do? Turn off the PlayStation? All right. Doubt that. We will start with a simple exercise. Mm -hmm. Could you please pick up the card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. Could you, would it, you it shut? It's essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. Are you gonna shut up now? Great! I want to say something. Oh my God! Look! Did you did you guys see his smile? Okay, hold on. I don't know the actor's name, the real name, but that's Abruzzi from Prison Break, for example, and he plays in, in a few other movies too, but Abruzzi is like the most outstanding name that I know right now, and I think that's awesome. Okay, what do I see? Uh, a sca- oh, an angry looking fucking scarecrow now. And now I have to lay it back down? So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, Un be honest. Comfortable. I feel uneasy. It makes me happy. 30% <laughs> of the people playing the game said it makes me happy. <laughs> hey, honestly, it's good. <laughs> oh my god. What do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? Maybe the angry looking scarecrow that's gonna slash me up. I, I watched Supernatural, bitch. I saw scarecrows well, come alive and kill everybody. Let's see. Scarecrow 
were not there, would you feel comfortable staying there on your own for a period of time? Let's say a week, for example. Um, nope, because there's no internet. What the fuck am I going to do? Oh, no. <laughs> Why not? Because there's no internet? I'd be lonely. Yep, no internet, lonely. There's a fine line between the peacefulness of solitude and the loneliness of isolation. Perhaps this is something we can explore in the future. Hmm? His smile. Because I'm afraid we're out of time. <laughs> oh! Not for now. Until the next session. And uh, until then, try to surround yourself with friends in a place that makes you feel... Not uncomfortable? Safe. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Thank you for your advice, though. Didn't need it. Abruzzi. Oh my god, do you guys think he has only... Oh no. Oh no, he cut the toe off of Schofield. But he did get his... Uh, throat slit. I didn't know. We're playing until dawn, guys. I didn't know that. Jesus. Doll for real. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. This is an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be oh. hiding there? My no, officers no. did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Thank you for joining us, Anthony. With all the Washingtons tonight, with their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. <laughs> I know you're all probably worried about me, and no. I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year. Why the fuck are they even going back? I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this, and I, I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, you know, thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and, um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for... For the sake of my sisters, and, you know. Okay, so... Let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make oh. this one trip <laughs> we will never forget, alright? Alright, yes. so that means alcohol, drugs, and bitches. 
Well, that's one hell of a party. Oh, that, that reminds me now of my bloody Valentine. All right. Oh, spiders. So can I finally play? <laughs> I would appreciate it. Is that me? Can I, can I, can I, can, can I walk? No, it's still not me. What? It's going down again. G give me a fucking second to breathe. Okay. All right. Oh my god. Someone there? Yeah, he's gonna answer. Yeah. I'm in the trees waiting to kill you. That's what he's gonna say. Part of the cable car station. Wait, can we can we go backwards? <laughs> let's see. Oh yeah, let's backtrack. Oh my god, is that gonna mean our death already? Is that already the first wrong decision I can make in this game? Oh is she what? Was that now because she's cold? Or is she actually excited? Oh, can you do that again? Do it again. No. Now she, now she just looks smug. Uh-oh. Oh, oh what the fuck? Oh, it's a bit... Oh! If I don't move, the camera goes up close. That's cool. I don't like her little skirt, though. Looks a bit ugly, but okay. Can we walk... Oh, no, we can't. Ah, uh, use the camera to move the camera. Where to, though? Yeah, okay. I'm trying to use... I can't- I can't go right or left. I can just go up and down. Alright. Let's go. We can't sprint, unfortunately. Oh, look at that crow. Use the right stick to look around objects that- yeah. I will do that. Oh, what? The gate is busted. Ah. Oh, damn it. Oh, what's that? Josh Washington, blah blah blah, Chris. Directions, Vancouver, mm, then... Oh, wait. Change at Terminus, then take the... The, 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 the. Yo, how do I get there again? <laughs> All right. Now I have to climb? Oh! Oh, Jesus. Never mind. Yeah, he just said that the gate is broken. How do we... Oh, okay. Then we have to climb over... Wait, can we eventually climb over the right wall? We're always going to do the not obvious thing in this game. Because... In my opinion, that helps us out the most. Safe, quick. Let's do the quick version, because we're adventurous. Oh, shit. I nearly missed, I nearly already slipped, I nearly died already. Jump. Come on, you're adventurous. Let's do this. Ah, yes. She's strong, though. Oh my god! Oh my god, but what if with those actions, we have shown that- Yeah! We have now showed him that we're actually good! So he's gonna step up his game! He's not gonna underestimate us! Oh my god, do you guys really think that that's what happened? That's what's happening right now? We're fucked. Oh, this is brain-fucking me so much! <laughs> this is really brain-fucking me. And now? Hello. You hungry? Huh? Don't move, okay? I'm not moving. <laughs> Cutie. Ah. Uh. If Holly were here, she would have killed that squirrel. She does that all the time in the Elder Scrolls. I swear to God, she always kills the squirrels. If you're if you are unsecure of what to do next, I okay. I fucked up. I missed it. Oh well. Hello, crows. Oh, there's a sign. 
Let's go to that sign then. The butterfly prophecies. <laughs> cool. Uh-oh. Oh my god! Indigenous pee blah blah and butterfly prophecies. Tribes who once lived in these mountains believed that the butterflies carried dreams and prophecies of possible futures. The color of the butterfly indicated the nature of the prophecy. Ah! Black butterflies? Death? Red butterflies danger? Brown butterflies foretold of tragedy, a uh, tragedy affecting friends? Guidance. Yellow butterflies offered visions to help. And white a fortune. I I will never remember that. Oh no! As you explore, you can discover totem artifacts. Picking a totem up and turning it will reveal a colored butterfly and a premonition of possible future. Let's, let's have a look! How we're gonna die. Oh no, that's guidance. Great. Okay. To the table, it showed the future is uncertain whether or not the prophecy comes true depends on the choices you make. Alright, so we had a table or something. It was uh, with a prophecy though. Ah! No, no, there was a table. And I think, I don't know, I think there was an apple on it. I'm not really sure. <laughs> oh god. The past is... What? Beyond our control. Let's have a look. The past is beyond our control. No shit. Okay, that's it? Great, thanks. <laughs> ah, this is now the the house then I guess. It's see? Oh look Take a look at the bag. Oh yeah. Where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? Ooh. <laughs> Don't be nosy, you don't do that. Okay, let's snoop. We do that, we are totally have to. Aha! Look who it is. Oh! I changed now the game, great. <laughs> oh! Chris! Shit. I I'm sorry. You scared me. I I'm sorry, are, are you my secretary? Yes, I am. Was buzzing. <laughs> cool, well. Thanks for letting me know. I, I can take it from here. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on. It's this way. Where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind. I was not even done yet. No! Hold on, bitch. I'm not even done with exploring yet. You hold the fuck on. Oh my god, and now he's gonna go out there all by himself, and now he's gonna die. And we split up the group. That means we're gonna all d Oh, can we go in? Let's do that. We can't. Of course. We have to fa- We have to go to the blow my mind area. Or whatever the fuck it is. Now let's go. Let's blow my mind. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Before you blow my mind. Ooh, wanted. Milgram Victor, no, male, 6'2". You think Last... you get a visit from America's Most Wanted? Yes. Like wanted in connection. So. Oh, come on. This place is abandoned most of the year. Nobody comes up here. Wanted in connection with a first degree arson offense. Oh, shit. Anyone with information regarding blah, blah, blah. Okay, so he's an arsonist. He likes, he likes to set things on fire. All right. What's over here? Nothing. I hope this entire game stays in the uh, snow. Is not I can't see. That comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, oh, a shooting have range. Ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. That blew He's my fucking dad. mind. Wanna try? Uh, now you go ahead, Grizzly. Well, that actually right. literally. Here goes. That can actually literally blow your mind. Good one. Oh, is it? Oh, we, is it up to me now? All right, I got this. Use the right stick to aim and press R2 to shoot. All right, we're going to shoot. Can we shoot her? No. <laughs> Boop. MLG. Boop. There you go. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a COD veteran. <laughs> Boop. 
That's easy. Wow, nice shooting text. All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. Yeah. Go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Especially with the dancing. Oh, but you know what? If that guy is what, I really don't know how far this game goes. Shoot a bottle that big, that close. No. 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 Nope. Not gonna shoot that scroll. No. Nice shot. Your ass just got sacked. <sighs> so cheesy. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. I really wonder if, it, if this game goes so far that, you know, like if we do something really good and that dude is always watching us, that this will affect how good he is, for example. Oh, yeah. Tell me about it. So we have to go now back to the... Oh, wait, wait, wait. What's here? Hello? No. It's a shame that we can never, like, kind of, like, get a glimpse of something at the dude looking. No, we already checked that. Yeah. No shit. Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. Alright. Boop. After you. A oh, real gentleman. Oh, hopefully we can get those snowboards. Oh, yeah, I'm down for that. What do we have to do now? Let's take a look. That's like a generator, I guess. The car was closer. I, uh, okay. I'm trying to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this going to take? I don't know yet. It's a big mountain. Yeah. I'm trying to figure it out. Oh. What's this? You're gonna publish? What a Blackwood, crazy okay. place to set up house. I mean, no Alright, I got it. Are, it's okay. Not so rich. They only bought a mountain. They bought a mountain? How can, how can you buy a mountain? What? Did they really say bought a mountain? How, how do you buy... Huh? There! I saw him! There was somebody in front of the house. And how do we bring the cable car then up? Or we really just have to wait, wait, wait. I think I checked everything out here now. Oh, okay, here we go. Finally, you coming? Yeah, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some Z's, but okay. Oh, shut the fuck up and move on. Now let's go into that cable car then, I guess, which is then most likely gonna break down and we're all gonna die. Great. Oh wait, can we walk back out of the door? As we did see somebody out there. Can we actually go out? Ah, no. Okay. We are not allowed to go out. Well then, let's go. Just like going to the prom. What? Here we go. Right. Adventure begins. Oh, you went to your prom right. in a cable car. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah. No, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, and I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> Bruh. You know what? Let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Ah, uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. No! And? 
and next to Josh. That's how we met. Oh my we God. Been friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early and on that day decided to wear a low cut shirt that showed up for training bra. I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Best story, 10 right out of 10. Now, IGN. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Oh. I see what you did there until dawn. I see what you did there. But until now, it's not that scary, huh? Nothing really happened yet. Oh, I don't like her face. Mike's new girlfriend. Oh, really? There. Oh, so Mike, the douche. That should have been the douchebag that pranked Hannah. And now he's with Jess. Irrelevant and trusting. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. So we're kind of like playing every character. Okay, I got it. Is there anything we can pick up here? No. Alright, let's go directly to the cable car. Or maybe not. <laughs> oh! What the hell? Jess! Hey! Jessica! Over here! Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? We just banged against the door. Boop! There you go! Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look. I got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. He's so weird. He has such a weird sense of humor. Hey, Chris. <laughs> He's so, like, like, really Sam cheesy. Other people's private thoughts are my own personal playground. Do you know uh... what you're doing, Jerk? My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. That's the butterfly. Uh, I'm with Mike now. Get, wait, give that back. Um, explain. Let's, uh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what to do! Insist, give that back. I want the explanation, I want to hear this. Mike and M split. We're together. Whoa, drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Huh. <laughs> Simple as it gets. All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. Oh my gosh, she's such a bitch. What? I mean, you know, whoever. Uh huh. Sam. <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow! It's beautiful. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. No, it's really beautiful, and that douchebag just said nature and junk. Like right where the cable car ends. Mike's ex. Oh, she does not seem pleased. Oh my god, she's angry as fuck. Resourceful and persuasive. Intelligent. Oh my god, she's about to kill somebody. I don't think it would have been like as pretty. Matt, Emily's new boyfriend. Oh, there you go. Ambitious and active. So technically, this is... So they are actually like this one little group and they are just fucking around. So technically, oh, you know, you're my boyfriend, they break up and then they just kind of like switch. That's one hell of, of a good friends group. No. And where's the bellboy when you need one? And they're really best friends. That's awesome. I'm being ironic right now. <laughs> Come on. Come on, strong man. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh. Yeah. Oh, can we? It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. I wonder if the bags are really heavy. Or if he's... I mean, oh, no, he's not. Ah! Jesus! Oh. <laughs> Douchebag. Intelligent, driven, and persuasive. Mike. Douchebag. <laughs> you guys. Michael. You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice. No, you did. Michael, didn't. you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods. It's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. He's a douchebag. Oh, That's what's wrong with what? him. 
the way you're being. You always get like this. Threaten, welcome. We're all friends here. Uh, um, 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 what are we gonna do? Um, yeah, you know what? No. I don't know, this is always so hard. I'm not, I'm not good with decisions. Alright, so he, he's a douchebag. He jumped out, blah, blah, to scare us. Then he's technically just kind of like normally talking. We're all friends. Yeah, okay, let's be the, let's not be directly the douchebag ourselves. Michael. I'm just gonna lay it out, otherwise this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, <laughs> this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Nah. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh, no. Way, totally. We're so gonna make out. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back down the trip. See you, man. See ya. I still don't like See it. See ya. I hope he falls down. I hope when he rides the cable car, oh, it's gonna rip. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. What? Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important. Matt, please. Persist, agree? I'm not now, nah, I'm not leaving her alone. Uh-uh. Em, I really don't think you should head back down the trail by yourself. Yeah. Seriously? It's yeah. cold out and it's getting dark. You're gonna protect me from it being dark out? I'll just leave your stuff here and come with you. Nobody's gonna steal it. Matt, oh, shit. are you kidding me? You can't leave Somebody me alone is going for to five him. minutes? You really think that little of me? That's not what I meant. Why can't you just listen to me? Why do you have to question everything I say? I'm sorry, Em. I'm just trying to be helpful. If you want to be helpful, then you can help get everything up to the lodge as quickly as you can, okay? Um. Uh, okay. Fine. That's how women Thank are. You. Right I'll there. there after I go find Sam. See you in a bit. That's the daily struggle us men have. Exactly that. Displayed really good. And that's that's real life. That's real life right there. <laughs> that is real life. <sighs> Has a crush on Chris. Alright. Was that our scream or wolf owling? <gasps> Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. And not in the friend zone kind of way. Oh my god, is that expiration date on their big breakup? Emily? Oh yeah. What what are these for friends? Oh! <laughs> oh! Hey, whoa. It got <laughs> Sorry me there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, what? Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real. Oh, oh my gosh, oh my god. Hey, wow. Man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash, damn. Good one. It's okay, it's fine, it's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, Your girlfriend. Let me check it out. Giving you shit for not being, for not trusting her and all that. Take a look. Uh, We're honest. Sure, uh, go, go ahead, knock yourself out, I guess. Ah, oh, oh, yeah. Bitch. There you go. Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. But nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I... Damn it. Matt. Ah, oh, yeah. Man, that's a that's a one one weird group. I can't get over it right now, how, how weird that group is. Read book, check phone. Um, 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 let's check the phone. <laughs> that's, 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 that's how kids are these days. Oh, you did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. Holy shit. Who am I to retaliate? 
What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? Wait, grab a snowball, run. Grab a snowball and throw it back. Now we're gonna get in in our face. No? I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> Bam! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Bullseye! Hey, you know that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chickadee? Chickadee. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, yeah! Oh, ah. Bullseye. Hey! Oh, square! Oh, snap! Oh, look! MLG. Ah! That's the tip! That's the clue! That's the totem! Come on! Shit, that's the totem right hey, there! Mike. Boom! Shakalaka! Oh, you got me? Okay. Sometimes doing nothing is the right thing to do. Okay. No. Do nothing. Why do they always want us to, to kill or hurt animals? What's wrong? Oh, oh kinky. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> Doubt that. Oh, shit. Gotcha. Done. Done city. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. Oh my god. All right, all right. My, my. <laughs> so are we calling it my favor then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Uh, kiss Mike. Grab, grab a snowball. Totally gonna do that. Ah! Boop! <laughs> oh ho ho. Okay. Okay, you're really gonna get it. What am I gonna get? Well, oh my god. I can think of at least one thing. Yeah. But what is it? We have to wait until later. <laughs> we should get up to the lodge. Yeah. No pun. No pun it's there. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? We weren't making out well, at all. Man, well, well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. I, I threw, like, snowballs in your face. That's not really making out, if you ask me. But, okay. Oh! There we go! Hello again. That was not part two of the story? And how are we? I trust that you have stayed in the company of good friends since our last session. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Okay. In the next episode, we're going to find out if men or, or women worry me. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Thank you very much for watching. And hopefully see you next episode. Bye-bye. Lieutenant Dan. <laughs> From Forrest Gump. <laughs> Lieutenant Dan, hold on. Ain't nothing but a chicken wing.